Welcome back, everybody. Mr. X joined by Jack Kirch Dunlop and Max Malo Odd Slice via Skype. Right now, we're just poking in, looking at FaZe versus Optic Nation. Optic Nation able to win the first map. I saw some tweets. Uh, I think it was Karma saying he was using an assault drone. Uh, oh. Kind of a shame we didn't get to see that, but obviously that TK versus Denagi, very important. Uh, guys, you know, kill streaks. they are... Uh, they're they're not banned. Uh, you know that's it's actually a uh, something that could happen. Do yeah. you think we're gonna see more people start using them now that uh, it looks like Karma uh, maybe accidentally using it or just decided to throw it on? I, I mean, I would love to see. I would love to see Killstreaks use more. I love that aspect of Black Ops too. Unfortunately, though, like the lightning strike and hellstorm equivalents in this game aren't really there the two big kill streaks we saw from black ops 2 also the kill streaks in this game do cost a lot now there's also the variations you could do on the kill streaks it's a whole another uh sort of thing so it's interesting to see as we all know karma hasn't been taking the league matches uh too seriously since uh, optic nations uh season has gone downhill so i don't know it's definitely it's definitely fun to see i don't know if we'll see it though in actual event what about yeah. you, Max? Um, I think the assault drone is a pretty good kill streak. The only problem with it is that it really immobilizes your player. You have to, you know, pilot it. Um, but yeah, missile strike. Not a fan of it. Don't think it's that good. Uh, Vulcan, not that good. Um, I think the assault. Uh, actually, there are some things that are on the streaks that are banned. There's some that are allowed. I wonder if support. No, no, support is not support is allowed banned. on the drone but i believe the one that controls it automatically is allowed so that you could technically do that can you put can you do the uh, rocket upgrade for the assault drone because that thing is insane yeah. you might be able to the rocket for that is just boom, it's a kill boom, it's a kill it's pretty now, sick now you see i didn't know there was actually an ai controlled drone uh yeah perfect so that oh, thing yeah. nope so. and then uh actually getting reports around the league from other spots envy versus prophecy Tied first map on hardpoint 179 179. Wow. So they are going to do a replay. Maybe if this one ends, nope, we can jump right into that one. We can just uh, talk about this. Nation coming out, get three right off the bat. It's going to be enabled. Last one alive. Let's do a quick listening with FaZe. See how you know the communication's going between Parasite and Eggs. back here with those double MGs. He probably might have. Step to AC. Oh, listen, shot. Man, that looks good on my screen. Don't do it. Bomb has been oh, what? Right, that one looks good. Alright, that did. I didn't, but okay. Love your knife, you're dead. <laughs> Dude, Proofy sprinted in the fucking building and killed me when I'm full health. You got gung ho on. No, I'm pre-aiming! Dude, man. I try to dash punch him. Or dash no scope him. I'm so fucking ass. Dude, how'd that knife hit you? Switching sides. Oh, I know. I knew it was coming though after I was mid-dash. <laughs> Search and destroy. Destroy the right. objective. What are you doing, Chris? Throw one nade there, top three. Then I'm gonna push up the bomb. Nade there, top three again, and plan. Oh no, there's that. There's second, sorry. I'm here with you. We're, we're pushing them. I'm not, I'm not gonna let them get back. There's nobody else here, guys. Unless bottom you're mid. Down, two there, bottom mid. I'm, I'm hallway right now. I thought we were pushing. Up. I was, I, I heard push. Dude, I was up top, so they were both down low. It's well, if I go top, you don't need to go top too. Is it 2v2 or 2v3? 2v3. They gotta be somewhere around here now. I'm their bottom A, Chris. I got one. I'm gonna call bomb over here. We're top three. Dude, what? Your head I'm not gone. even. On my screen, he has a snipe. He has a snipe. Our top three. No, on my screen, I didn't even see him. The bomb has been planted. Keep it, Felony. Felony's gonna rush you 100%. Right, well, you saw that one guy dash. Yeah. 
I think they're just trying to bait you out. Oh, he has a C1 on this, easy. Choo choo choo. Woohoo! I even hurt it. Good job. What? Yeah, that didn't even look like it was close on my screen. I don't know why it's like. Okay. Uh, let's go there. This host is ass, dude. I don't know what the hell you're doing to your host right now, but it's awful. That was okay, textbook. That's how my host works. I, I don't get to play on good host ever. It wasn't like that earlier. I was like, what the hell? It's just like, I was getting bullshit by the fucking yeah, proof it, and felony. It lags spikes a lot. All right, there we saw FaZe. They are able to tie that one up with Optic Nation 1-1. One, one. A lot of people don't think Optic Nation was going to be able to win many maps tonight, but came out looking pretty good. Uh, doing pretty well. Know, yeah, doing pretty well for themselves. Right now, though, we are going to be jumping into this first map between Denial and Optic Gaming. It's going to be Hardpoint on Solar, one of Optic Gaming's favorite maps. Uh, I'm expecting big things from them on this one. Oh, 100 percent. I mean, I can't remember the last time Optic Gaming lost a hard point to start a series. And if there's any player I want to watch up the start, it's going to be Skunk. We talked about him in today's uh, kind of celebrity draft or fantasy draft we did, and he's got the best stats across the board here in league play season one. Him and Formal have been going back and forth uh, each week, you know, holding on to who has oh, yeah. the highest KD and whatnot. And right now you're going to see Skunk. He's playing this perfect. I actually love this out of him. And there's something we've seen different out of Skump is that on you know, previous games, uh, especially Black Ops 2 Hardpoint, you know, he, he could kill, but he, he didn't kill effectively. He was in weird spots, you know, just not really you know, killing to help his team. But in this game, he has just changed completely. I definitely think uh, Krim has a little bit to attest to that. Oh, 100%. And you can see right now, Optic Gaming in full control here, already up by 20 seconds, Krim 6. Is five and one here. Scump at four and one himself. Formal yet to get a kill, but you know, Matt, when the entire rest of his team is slaying everything around the hill, you don't really have to look for kills if you're getting that objective done. There are only, there are only so many kills on the map, Jack. Uh, you're yeah. just so, somebody's bound to not end up with a, a lot. You know, when, uh, I think it's funny, especially uh, time to time. You know, Max, when I see people you know, talk about optic gaming, and it's like, oh, you know, Grim's not playing as well as he used to be. And it's like, well, you know, when. Formal has 40 and Scump has 40. It's difficult for that third person you know, to get you know, 40 kills as well. So definitely these guys are still as skilled as always. It's just, you know, they're yeah. kind of taking turns a little bit. And, you know, a lot of people thought when this team change originally happened, you know, is Scump going to still be as explosive of a player as he's been? You know, what, how's that going to work with Nate? Is Nate just going to always just be diving into that objective? And, you know, it's wound up working out completely fine. I mean, Nate is still that objective player. He doesn't drop the huge numbers. Skump still puts up massive numbers, and all these players have their moments of brilliance. As you can see right now, Optic Gaming up by 50 seconds still. Finally, Denial able to hit the 10-second 10, the 10 mark after two minutes, Matt. Very, uh, very difficult time for Denial right now. Clayster on your screen, though. He's going to be trying to break this back hard point. Going to jump in with that foul. Would have liked to see one of the other players with an ASM challenge first. Jcap going to try and push that hill. It's going to be a tat. She's going to be jumping in as well. Nothing uh, nothing from Denial working. They're kind of just flooding this one by one, and that's definitely not the way to go about things. Skump, though, absolutely destroying. 14 and 4. Uh, you know, day by day. I I've been saying it. I think Formal, you know, best overall player, most consistent. I think Krim, you know, right up there as well. Uh, Day by day, uh, you know, Scout makes me look stupid. <laughs> hey, no, he's just he's just a dominant player now. Optic still up by a minute. And something I want to point out here, Matt, is as this hill rotated, Replays was going for a flank on the back garage uh, parking lot area, but he actually was finally taken out there. He was able to pick up two, but that was a crucial kill from Optic Gaming because instead of letting that pinch happen and then losing that hill, they were able to keep rotating in. Denial was getting killed over and over there on pipe side, and look right now. Optic Gaming first on the rotation and getting those last seconds in the last hill. They're doing everything right here, Matt. Absolutely, Jack. I 100% agree. You see Optic uh, Gaming on your screen. They were actually on that rotation first. Nate shot, though, able to get killed out of the hill. It's going to be replays, though. He's going to have three players pushing him from his left. They like to the play. He's just going to lay down. going to have teammates looking over him. Attach pushing. Clayster looking cross side with his bow on your screen right now. He's going to be controlling the hill. You know, Optic Gaming, they're going to have to stun both sides. They're going to have to pinch to get this hill back. 
Yeah, and Matt, you brought up a great point there. What people have been talking a lot about is Optic Gaming Online. They're so confident, they just flood the hill. If, if they trade all their kills and just flood it with the four of them, then that's fine. But something we saw on LAN, and one of their biggest issues that Skump brought up at Columbus was on night one when they were struggling so bad was that they were just trying to flood it just like they were online. And on LAN, it's much different. You need to go for those pinches. We did see here Optic Gaming able to do that as Nade wound up going through pipes there, but as the hill rotates, finally Denial getting there first. Yep, Denial able to get in there first, doesn't matter. Scumpy's gonna jump in, kill that one player in the hill right away. He's got players spawning in front of him. Looks like he's gonna be having Formal over there to help him out. Formal starting to heat up a little bit. Started out, I believe, five and nine, up to 11 and 15 right now. So Formal starting to come alive a little bit, but, but Denial able to keep control of that hill, still, you know, holding it down. It looks like Jcap is in there doing some work as well as replays. Replays was doing uh, pretty well in the hill. Now he's gonna be spawned all the way out. Yeah, Denial doing a great job here of having players in position, knowing right where Optic's gonna spawn. You know, the player replays right now in the middle of the map, and I love this play from him. He's actually flanking around here. He's gonna pick up Formal. Can he find a second here in the hill? He's spraying down, but right there, still just caused mass hysteria, and look at that break right there again from Denial. Beautiful play coming out of replays. Denial's starting to come alive a little bit, and I think it's really because Jcap. Jcap playing pretty well right now. 19-17, the only one who is positive for this Denial team. They're gonna need Attach, though, to play much better, though, Jack. 14 and 24, having a pretty rough first half. Then over on the Optic side, you know, Krim and Skump playing well. Nade Shot doing exactly what Nade Shot needs to do. Eight caps, even, perfect. You you take that from Nade Shot every time. Formal at even right now, needs to step it up a little bit. You know, they rely on these three Slayers so much to pick up a majority of their kills. Gonna need them to play a little bit better. And right there's a perfect example, right, Matt, of what Optic Gaming just does better than most teams, and it's just staying alive in the hill. Scump had two players jumping above him. He was able to pick up one, hide behind that pipe there in the middle of the bottom hill, then kill the other, giving them another five to seven seconds, Matt, which over the course of a game can definitely add up. Absolutely, yeah, I know. Those little t chunks of time can definitely add up. You don't want to be playing for that garbage time too much, though. Attach on your screen. See if he can make anything happen mid-map. He's not going to be able to, but Denial, you see all the blue arrows trying to be set up for this next hard point, and they're going to get control of it first, but Skump comes in right through the mid-cut. Double positive right now, absolutely destroying. Max, you are actually checking in on some other games. Anything interesting going on elsewhere in the COD League right now? So I'm tuning in right now with Aix on phase against Optic Nation. The series is tied one to one after they won uh, so, uh, S and D six to three. Um, <laughs> right now, though, they're down two to one actually to Optic Nation, um, nearing the end of the first half here. Uh, some questionable loadouts. Not sure who's taking what seriously or what's going on. But uh, Phase looks like they're about to put in their second cap of the game. Yes, it is. It's going to be tied 2-2 with 40 seconds left. Yeah, uh, I think I here. just peeked over and I saw a sniper shot come out of one of the players on Optic Nation. I would bet yeah. very considerable amounts of money that would be karma. And, uh, you know, hey, if it works or it's working, might as well. And it looks like uh, you know, Denial is still trying to make this comeback. Clayster, though, really needs to step it up. Attach, he's come alive a little bit, though. Still, 32 deaths. We're going into the third hard point on the second rotation. Attach is 32 deaths. That is yeah. a ton of just times attacking the hill, just not successful. But I do like the aggressive play out of him, though. If you're going to be able to, you know, play with Optic Gaming, you're going to have to, you know, win those gunfights and be aggressive. And, you know, Matt, something I do want to point out right now, Optic Gaming as a team is just shy of positive 30. And that is... Just disgusting amounts of outslaying here as the scoreboard shows that. Zopta Gaming still up by a full 100 seconds here, winding down in the last two and a half minutes. Matt, what is it about these teams that they really need to step up? Is it the gun skill? Is it the teamwork? Or is it just the overall chemistry of Optic Gaming right now that just puts the league ahead, leagues ahead? You know, I think it comes down to something as simple as gun skill. You're just yeah. going to have to outgun these guys. That's the way... You're going to have to outgun them, and, you know, you're going to have to get a few lucky breaks, to be honest. I mean, right now, you see Krim. He took out two over on this glass side. That third guy doesn't even want to challenge. That per player needs to just challenge him right away. Uh, but it's going to be difficult. You can't really see, you know, a series where Krim, Skump, and Formal all don't play well, or two of them don't play well. I just don't see it happening anytime yeah. soon. And you see Skump right there. It makes it look so easy in the hill. Just... 
know, hanging and out, picking up two pieces. Something to point out here, Matt, is look at how confident Optic Gaming played that hill right there. They wound up pushing that all the way out to where Matt uh, Nade was almost at the second hard point on the pipe side, and on the other side of the map, Formal was all the way pushed down towards Glass Wall. They were playing that aggressive, knowing that, you know, we're gonna win our gun battles here. Just kind of making the difference there, catching the opponents off guard. They're now only 16 seconds away from winning this game and taking game number one. Yeah, Clay, so the only one right now in the back of this hard point. He's got one player with him, but he is taken out. Clay is going to have two players in front of him. He's going to take out one. The second player is just going to book it out of there and just run towards that next hard point. I like that play. That was actually Scump. That's the difference, though, between Scump on AW and Scump, let's say, you know, Black Ops 2. Black Ops 2 probably would have challenged that. Probably wouldn't have made that play. Right now, though, Scump, you know, just thinking on a different level game-wise. Matt, someone we haven't touched on yet attach is 23 and 42 yep. and with this denial squad especially when a lot of teams as you mentioned before are trying to match optic in the slang department or do their best to they're never going to win a game with attach going almost double negative j cap negative seven himself clay even and finally replays turning it up here 31 and 35 with 12 capture so you can't ask much more from your objective player but really the big difference maker in this game was attached just playing flat I think so and then I also J cap you know played a pretty good first half fell fell apart really in the second half you know couldn't really get anything going in the slang department so optic gaming going to win the first map against denial True. actually max if we uh, no sorry max uh, you're already what? here you're watching the game uh, Ron if we can throw it over to this phase O N game real quick yeah, and we can just go to a listening with Aix and FaZe in the last, you know, two minutes. See if they can hold on to win this CTF game against Optic Nation. Top, no, jump down. All right, we're going to see FaZe. They're going to win this CTF first. Optic Nation, pretty convincing fashion. Now. And we're going to go to a quick commercial break. When we come back, we're going to have Optic Gaming going up against Denial. It's going to be Search and Destroy on Terrace coming up right after this. <laughs> 